Less than. All right, man. We gotta we gotta tighten this this show up. All right. We gotta we gotta goddamn get into our journalistic bag. Get back into it. Okay. We're doing a lot of rumor mill things. And I mean, this is this And the is, people love it. Don't get me wrong. The people love it. But somebody's being sued. That's still, She's a celebrity, you but can it's get still, sued off the rumor. It's still courts and things involved. We we kind of doing a journalism. I feel it. We're, let's do a journalism for real though. For, we bring it in the fucking real president. Deal. Our former president. Donald Trump's indictment. This shit is getting interesting now, ladies and gentlemen. Explain to us what is happening. So I know where we every day, left and right, you hear about uh your boy Trumpito getting indicted here and there, but this one is different. Because in this in this new document, it was like a 47 page document that was released for this indictment. They have six co-conspirators. Goddamn. And the reporters have uh, identified, I think, five of the six. One of them being a former, I think he was a New York mayor, Rudy, uh, Rudy Giuliani. Correct. Fuck Rudy Giuliani. Rudy Giuliani. Fuck. Nah, dead ass, dead ass, Rudy, fuck you. That's a nasty. Nobody, nobody. We nobody, saw you on Borat. Nobody likes you, and I hope you rot in jail. I don't know if he's going to go to jail. I want him to go to jail. I'm just going to tell you. But, but he can just, I want him to die. Go ahead. But these, but essentially they have six uh, co-conspirators. Few of them are also attorneys. They have not indicted them yet. Mm-hmm. But. Essentially, they have a track record that show not only shows, but proves that Donald Trump uh, knew that he had lost the election, mm-hmm. knew he was trying to attempt to uh, rig, <coughs> excuse me, <clears throat> knew he was attempting to rig and stop votes from being counted, mm-hmm. and then he had a pike part to play in the coup. In the coup. Like, they, I'm talking about, they have things where they are, we have people saying. Oh, so they have evidence that he. They have folks where people have said in their document, Mr. President, these, everything has been authenticated. They have a conversation with him and at Pence mm-hmm. where he's talking to Pence and Pence says, sir, there's nothing constitutionally wise that I can do to change the, vote, the results of the election. You know what he says to Pence? What? You're too honest. Did I say that <laughs> like him? He said rig the election. I think I need to, I need to see if I did, I did I say that like him? I want to I want to make sure I get my impression. I don't know. I feel like you should have done a more like <laughs> get, you get know? there. You're too honest. You you're too honest. You're too honest. I feel like you're putting too, too much too, too much too New York in there. Yeah, like he's it's He's like an older New York. It's it's an old New York, but it's also just like a dirty Trump. Like nobody else sounds <laughs> Understand this? Pence, you're too honest. <laughs> that was a little bit, a little better. bit better. A little, little better. bit better. We're not the best at impersonations. We're gonna work on it. That's not our bag. We're gonna get in. That's there. not something we promised y'all. I got, I got some good impersonations though. I got a few. Do one. What's your best impersonation? No, I'm not gonna be doing this over here. Okay with you? Okay. You okay. Here, you're talking to me. You're being crazy. I'm a crazy ah. motherfucker. Okay. Oh. I will come over here and snap your neck. Bite the fucking no, ear. that's really good. <laughs> right? I don't know if I'm biased because I'm in love with you or not. No, that but... was good. That was great, my type. <laughs> <laughs> no, your face I, I, changed so I, I, quick. I, I, I bite the fucking head off, okay? Don't, don't say that Ooh, to me, okay? okay? All right? I'm a sick motherfucker. <sighs> Talk to me like that in bed later. <laughs> <laughs> whoa, you want me to talk to you like another man? Hold on, whoa, no, hold on. We need to bring this out on. Do it we need was to- a joke because he has a lisp and I res- I don't respect. You know what? Let me not. It's a speech impediment. <laughs> y'all not. Y'all don't have no control over that. All right, so then after this nigga Trump, it's pretty much it's out of his options. He goes to plan C where essentially – he leads. He he does the th- he puts the things in place. He says the the speech on the six mm-hmm. that incites a riot, and then we have you know the insurrection that we have on January six. So not only these are things that have been detailed in these other indictments, but like now we have like concrete like documents showing. So what was he trying to do? So, essentially, he was trying to do this first. He was trying to fake votes. 
He was trying to get real votes out and fake votes in. And that didn't work. Do we know how? Yeah. He was trying to get, uh, he was trying, who was he trying to use it with? Essentially, because I was, I was reading, I was listening and reading some stuff about it earlier, but he was essentially trying to get fake electoral votes to be accounted and he was trying to get real votes not counted for. What? And then he tried to get Pence to basically essentially say I mean, certain votes. Could, that's didn't why count. the electoral college is fucking nonsense. I mean, it is. But I mean, he, even then, like he couldn't get around it. He even tried to get Pence to use his power as the vice president, you know, of Congress to try to hold off on everything. Nothing that they could do. No, nothing. They no, no a whole nothing they could do. So the other plan was, shit, let's get this coup started, and then we'll use the Insurrection Act because this is what they said in the documents. This is what the Insurrection Act is for to quell the protest. So essentially, conservatives, Trump supporters, anybody who's there January six. He was going to kill you. He was going to kill you. Wait, okay, what do you mean? He, the, the plan was to quell the protests uh-huh. with the military. So I, don't know, incited, I don't know what else that means. He incited the protests to use the military to, to stop the protests? Yeah. But what would that do for... Because of the attack on everything, you could then hold off on the ele- you could. Oh, you know, there's, there's different it things. would definitely make every... Okay, so now you that's can, crazy. That's where it was going to. This nigga wild. This nigga is diabolical. <laughs> like, for real. This is and a none real. None of it worked. No, none of it worked. And they all look fucking. So, even they were either the most sinister motherfuckers on the planet or they were the most bumbling idiots that fell into almost <laughs> leading a, cu- a coup. One, no, no, no other way behind it. It's either one or the other. Because the military didn't, like, do anything. Yeah, nobody. No, the military didn't come. Yeah, it was a bunch of white men. They, they were did like, some, let them, let them, let them like, oh, they shit off. Those are, those are our brothers. <laughs> those are our brothers. Literally, that's my brother Tommy. I'm not <laughs> doing shit. <laughs> Craziness. Craziness. So, like I said, this nigga Trump is insane. So, it's going to be interesting. The The Fulton County Court said that, you know, because Georgia was one of the places he was trying to, uh, you know, put fake votes in. Mm-hmm. And they were saying, hey, if it's shown that he's done something wrong, we will arrest him and treat him like anyone else. Now there's a judge in Pennsylvania that's saying they're not they're, they're not gonna you know try him for anything because of his presidential status or whatever. That's bullshit. Yeah, it's stupid as fuck. That's absolute bullshit because if you're guilty, jail. That's what's or happening. Or whatever punishment comes with what you're guilty for. Hey, he probably got to make America great hat right in the back, so he probably got it tucked up. So. But it's it's it's, gonna, it's getting interesting. Like at the end of the day, we know there's gonna be having to get people to talk. That's gonna probably be the tricky part. But Pence looks like he fed up with this nigga. Pence has probably been fed up with this nigga for a while because Pence is like an old school like he's he's an old school racist. Pence don't sit in the same room <laughs> alone with a woman. Like, like Pence, <laughs> Pence, old school misogyny racist. Yeah, like, like he's conservative, conservative. Like he don't like, breathe the same air as a. He's color. like original conservative for like the authentic. Like I don't even recognize niggers. Uh, type conservative. Trump's type of racism versus Pence's type of racism is like old money versus new money. Yeah, that's annoying. It's flashy. I don't like it. Mm-hmm. Y'all are less than to me, and I think less of you. Like Trump, like Trump is the rich nigga who incorporates the black people in his stuff in his business and the rich white folks who don't even have to look at their customers like what are you doing why are you hanging out why are those people around yeah like why do you why do you need these people you need these people we move them around we're, we're letting the color willingly the way we we want them to move around we're, we're, we're letting the colors vote again <laughs> <laughs> thought, but we, thought we put an end to that <laughs> you need the colors to vote for you just to win <laughs> Shell out millions of dollars and and buy your power. What kind of cracker are you? <laughs> and the 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 people who are actually powerful, who we have no idea about, they're like this clown. You're a clown. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Someone fuck with him though. Someone fuck with him heavy though. I mean, you fuck with a stupid puppet. Yeah, I mean. I'm of just talking course. about. I'm talking about. They be publicly fucking with him, and they be acting like he be, they be letting he be letting that nigga son him too. Like that's the thing. That's the sick part about Trump. Like niggas be letting Trump son him. No, I feel like Trump just doesn't give a fuck. That nah, nigga these niggas be letting. Not- that. No, Ted Cruz. He let that nigga talk about his wife, and then he gave him his. Oh, okay, yeah, you could, you good, Trump. I fuck with you. No, these niggas. I mean, he pussy. had to. They have an agenda. 
Nah, dog. I ain't saying that. You somebody talk about my wife, nigga. It's over. It's up. Yeah. Smoke. Period. Smoke, nigga. Period. I agree with that. For real. I have nothing <laughs> else to say. <laughs> <laughs> but no, it's gonna be interesting to see where this goes. So we're definitely gonna keep y'all posted. If y'all still with us, like, follow, comment, subscribe. We definitely want to hear what y'all got to think about these topics that we've been on to today. 